Hello rainbows, welcome back to my channel. So I am so excited for today's video. I am going to be unboxing some Lush goodies. Not just any Lush goodies, but Halloween Lush goodies. Oh my gosh. Honestly, I feel so, so excited and so blessed and lucky because this is actually a PR package from Lush. And you guys know how much I absolutely adore Lush. Not only are they cruelty free, they have great vegan options, but they're just freaking amazing. And I've been a massive supporter of them for as long as I can remember. So to be able to actually be recognized by them and get a PR package, I was like, oh my God. <laughs> yeah, so very excited. All right, I haven't opened this yet because I've wanted to do it on camera to get my true reaction. So I'm going to just click this box away that's come up on my computer. Okay, so I'm going to open this now and we'll experience the goodies that are in here together. All right. First thing I can see is like this lid kind of sticking out which you, oh, oh, there, oh, there go the peanuts. So I can see this lid sticking out. Oh my gosh. Okay, so this is what I see. And this is green. And I just realized my backdrop is green. So I'm gonna get rid of the backdrop for a sec so you guys can actually see this. <laughs> oh, that's the joys of using a green screen for your backdrop, hey. So this is called Lord of Miserable if I'm pronouncing that correctly. Oh my gosh, I hope I am. So this is a shower cream. This is a big one. This is 500 mils. It's vegan and it says, expose yourself to this intoxicating, naughty concoction crowned in the earthly patchouli, hot spices and frothy reveille. Rev, rever, rever, <laughs> I can't say that word. Okay, so I'm going to smell this. Oh my gosh, it smells amazing. Hold on, we'll just open this up. Whoa, it smells so good. Definitely patchouli, definitely patchouli, but it also has in it, what else am I smelling? It's got black pepper, vanilla, and yes, yeah, spices. It kind of does remind me of like the chai lattes or something like that with a mixture of patchouli in it, which smells just so good and I love the color. Ugh. All right, green screen back on. <laughs> this is the next goodie I have picked out which is this, and this is the, I'm having a really hard time pronouncing stuff today, Ectoplash, and it says, prove you ain't afraid of no ghost, <laughs> and take a dip into the supernatural slimy jelly waters. What? It is a slime, slimy jelly water. Does this turn your bath into jelly? Oh my gosh, because I have seen I have seen those videos and I thought they were only in the UK because I tried to get one in Australia and I was like, <gasps> take a dip into supernatural slimy jelly waters. Oh my God. Oh my God. <laughs> okay. I'm going to have to film this. I'm going to have to see if this actually will turn my bath into jelly. I'm going to have to do that today. And it said that this is a grapefruit scented one. So I'm going to open this up. Oh my gosh, it smells amazing. I love like citrusy kind of scents. So yeah, this definitely smells incredible. It's purple and it has lots of yellow dots all over it. Oh, it smells amazing. Oh my gosh, if this is a jelly bomb thing, I'm going to cry. <laughs> oh, okay, so. This is the next thing I've pulled out. This is Monster's Bowl, a monster mashup of lime and neroli oils. Have you feeling frank and fine all night long? Oh my gosh, I'm gonna open this one up. And it is literally like a little monster. One-eyed, <laughs> one-eyed monster. <laughs> um, with little, little blue horns. It smells beautiful. Definitely like the lime kind of scent, but it's like it's like a lime ice cream. Like it has a creamy kind of scent to it as well. Mm, so nice. The next thing I'm pulling out is this pink pumpkin, and it says crumble under running water and immerse yourself in iridescent pink waters and the be bewitching of the land of bergamot and jasmine. Oh my gosh, it's so cute. So it's literally shaped like a pumpkin. And has a, it seems like it's got glitter all over it as well. 
Oh my gosh, it feels really, really soft and just like this is gonna be super moisturizing on the skin. It smells incredible and it has like a little bit of, um, it's like, like cinnamon stick or something sticking out of it. So it's like a little pumpkin with its stem. Oh, so good. And it's definitely got some glitter on it because my fingers are like glittery. <sighs> Next thing I'm diving into and finding is this. Oh my gosh. It's like a pumpkin carving on it. And this is the pumpkin bath bomb. It's a bath o' lantern. Cozy up with its spicy sweet pumpkin pie fragrance of cinnamon and vanilla. <gasps> oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I can kind of smell it through the packaging already. <gasps> oh my gosh. Wow, it looks just like a pumpkin. It's got the pumpkin carving on it. <sighs> Smells freaking amazing. Mm, yum. I love this. I could like literally, I want to take a bite of that. It smells so good. Next thing is this. This is Bewitched. It says crumble under running tap for perfectly dark, mysterious waters shrouded in rich bubbles and the spellbinding fragrance of olive Venom and bergamot. Look at it. Look at it. Oh my gosh. Is this, this is like a black bath bomb. <gasps> it's like my soul. So this is what it looks like. It's got little spooky eyes on it. it smells really good. It has quite a different scent from all the others. Like it's not, I don't know how to explain it. It smells good though. Like it's almost like a darker, richer, I don't know, mysterious scent. Not that that is really narrowing it down. Most of the others kind of felt, smelt like quite fresh and like lively, whereas this is like quite mysterious and sensuous smelling in a way. <laughs> All right, so this is the next thing I'm seeing. This is a sparkly pumpkin. Crumble under running tap water and be hypnotized by the swirling, shimmering waters and fruity lime and juniper berry foam. <gasps> oh my gosh. Guys, look at this. <gasps> it is so glittery. <gasps> wow. And again, it's like the other kind of pumpkin one, shaped like a pumpkin with a little bit of a cinnamon stick. Crazy amounts of glitter on it. it smells incredible. This is not as like sweet as the other one, but still smells really, really nice. <gasps> Another one, and this is another green one, so I'm gonna have to get rid of the green screen again. Um, so this is Lord of Misrule. So I think this is the same as the shower gel. So it says, revel in your bath with this mischief, mischievous bomb that features a spicy herbal blend of patchouli and black pepper oil. Just drop a Lord of Misrule into a full bath and enjoy the fizz. Oh my gosh, it smells awesome. Smells exactly the same as the shower gel. And this is how it looks. It is green, it has little bits of pink and little bits of kind of yellow speckles in it as well. And it's pretty big. It's a decent size. <laughs> so this is the Black Rose Solid Lip Tint. That's awesome. I'll read it before I tear it open. Thorn to be wild. Spread a little love with this Sicilian mandarin and yang yang oils and slay all day with this long lasting magenta lip. Oh my gosh, that is so cool. Oh, I so want to put this on, but I've already got this on my lips. It smells good. Okay, so they are all of my lush Halloween goodies. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited and just cannot wait to try those. I'm going home to do that jelly bath. <laughs> like I really hope that's jelly because it's going to be amazing. <laughs> so I want to say a huge thank you to Lush Australia for sending out these goodies to me. Honestly, I feel just, I don't know. I can't even explain it. So, so spoiled and just, <laughs> I just love it. <laughs> so thank you so much. Um, thank you rainbows for watching. It has been a really long time since I've done a Lush haul only because uh, my closest Lush store is down in Perth and yeah, I know you can buy online, but I love just going in store. So next time I'm down there, I'm definitely going to get some goodies and do another haul for you guys. So yeah. <laughs> all right, guys, I love you all and I'll see you guys in my next video. <laughs> Bye.
him, baby, you should find a way.